what is up and everything guys so honestly this is about as impromptu as it gets i came back up here to turkey mountain because i was driving over the bridge and i saw what looked to be a whole flock of pelicans down on the river but on one of the banks where i can actually get close to so it is 40 degrees outside i'm probably gonna have to strip the thicker jacket because i'm gonna be walking and climbing but let's go see if we can find them. I am not gonna film a whole boring walk. I don't have anything but my phone today, so I'll apologize for the quality. I'm gonna apologize for the sound, and let's go have some fun. Okay, so I'm a little winded. I did just have to walk quite a ways to get up here. I'm about to jump on a rock. Cause, uh, okay, there, now I'm not sinking into the ground anymore. So it looks like there's a small group of them and it's really hard to walk through this stuff and be quiet so i'm gonna try and film this while i'm walking so that way if they take off you guys can still see them um and then i'm probably getting out of here because uh it's not super cold but it's really muddy so let's see if we can see these pelicans i'll tell you guys what the downside to this is that the muddier or spots are actually the quietest which i am I, I don't even think I can at this point. I'm just hoping I can get over there a ways without having to trail through like what is directly in front of me, which is essentially just a giant gross mud bog. And it doesn't look like I'm getting that lucky. Oh God. Yep. Yeah, that just happened. I mean, you guys can see them. They're right there on that rock. It looks like if I just keep walking this way, though, it won't be quite as bad. Let me zoom this out. All right, you know what, guys? I need uh, all my wits about me, so I'm just gonna walk. I'll see you guys when we get closer. All right, I know you guys can see them, and I'm still gonna try and get closer, but I think I've spooked them to the point where they're all gonna kind of swim away. Ah, uh, shit, now my foot's wet. We're going. You guys see him? I think that's about as close as I can get, unfortunately. I mean, super unfortunately, because I mean, they're like right there. I just, I, just, I want to show you guys like what I'm battling here. And it's just a lot, but there they are. Maybe if I go more this way, get you guys a more direct shot. I don't know, let's go find out. Okay guys, I think this is about as best as you're gonna get. I kind of was hoping that there'd be a way across to like that island, but I ain't gonna get that lucky. They're actually all sitting out on that one there. Now they're all right there. So, well, at least we got a look. I know you can't see them very well. There's just a whole flock of pelicans just hanging out, so. All right, and the ever-present plains when you're down by the river. So, all right, maybe we'll find something else on the way back, but until then, guys, I'm just gonna call, cut this one right here for the pelicans anyway. Here's something I passed trying to find the birds, but uh, if you guys wanna see what like fresh evidence of beavers being here look like, it doesn't get no fresher than that, people. Like, I probably scared the poor guy off. They just finished off this tree. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Ugh. Not a whole lot to show you there since there's not actually the beavers, but I mean, it doesn't get any fresher than that, that they are around here. He's probably just out there in the river waiting for me to meander my way back up this hill. So, all right, let's get rolling. Probably the last time we'll be close enough. So I figured I'd just give you a, a quick send off of the pelicans just hanging out in the water there. Basically, I just scared them from one island to the other, and I just found a freaking cockerbird patch, so I'm covered in sticky things. But there you go, guys, so let's get back up this hill. Whew. Okay, sorry about the look, and of course, it figures the one time I actually have something to show you guys, I don't bring any of my camera gear. So what I really want to show you guys is I was walking by the bank over here and here walking by that bank 
and I noticed they had a bunch of their trees wrapped around with uh, metal so that way the beavers can't uh, eat the wood and break down the trees that are growing next to the bank. So I saw this while I was walking by and it looks like the beavers here have done enough damage where they've actually had to put uh, some wire around the base of the tree so that way the beavers don't completely take them down and erode the entire bank here. So, <sighs> alright, let's get back to it. So, that got me kind of looking around and there's a lot of evidence of beavers, obviously, but this is the cool part. I'm going to show you guys in a second. So, everyone thinks beavers, they think, oh, beavers build dams and live in beaver huts. Well, that's not entirely true. Sometimes what beavers will do is, sorry, I thought I saw something cool underneath the rock. But anyway, sometimes beavers, beavers will do is they'll tunnel into the side of a uh, mud bank and they'll build their den and inside of the ground and I think they do that more around winter because it'll also keep it nice and warm in there so what I want to show you guys now is one of the tunnels that they've dug and that's pretty much what these beavers living in this little pond right here um, will use as opposed to like an actual dam so here let me let you guys see it all right guys there's the hole I know it doesn't look like much and I'm going to try and get closer, but as you guys can see how it's been tunneled out just straight into there. Let's go see if we can get a closer look. Oh, it's like the muddiest walk I've had. And I was like in a long time. Okay. So there's about the best look. Maybe if I zoom out. Yeah. You guys are going to get of it and i can tell it's pretty active because you can actually see in the water well i hope you guys can see the glare is horrible where they've kind of dug deeper in and moved all the dirt out so let me see if i can't give you guys a look inside at least as far back as you're going to be able to see oh man i'm probably going to fall in when i do this i don't know if you guys can see anything all right guys that's pretty much it um i'm pretty sure i'm not gonna be filming anything else all the way back up to my truck since that's not too much farther a walk and so yeah guys if you like what you saw please leave a like and subscribe follow me on instagram which i'll put that at the end and until next time guys i will see you later and everything peace